Okay, everybody, welcome back to Cyber Sharks Computer Repair and Gaming. My name is Gamerwoman 3D. Sort of my name. Uh, we're gonna play a little more Rogue Legacy today. Uh, last episode, uh, we found out why uh, you don't go within somebody named uh, Sir Useless. Uh, -oh. uh, it's actually going to be Halloween, so we're actually going to be playing quite a few Halloween games. We're going to be playing more Halloween games. Oh, where's that? Okay. Uh, we'll be playing some more Halloween games uh, for several different reasons. Uh, one, I really like Halloween. Uh, Halloween, it's not really a satanic holiday or anything like that to me. It might be to some people who are of that religious persuasion. I'm not particularly religious uh, in any religion. But uh, to me, Halloween is a holiday of creativity. So to suppress that holiday is kind of bad. And I have noticed that uh, locally, maybe not where you're at, but where I am at, uh, they started playing Christmas music like three weeks ago. And we're not even to our United States, it's not even to their Thanksgiving holiday yet. So it's a bit ridiculous and a bit redundant. I don't want to be listening to Christmas music for three months out of the year, October, November, and all of December. So. Uh, in kind of a protest to that, uh, we're gonna be doing like a lot of Halloween games through Christmas. I think it's gonna be a blast. All right. Anyway, let's go back to Rogue Legacy. Choosing your heir. Oh, giant, Lady Lisa, the Paladin. Uh, standard hero, pretty good at everything. Guardian shield is there special? I don't know what that is. Oh, that's right. That's where you can hit Y, and it will actually block everybody. Um, at least that's what it said. Um, I'm obviously not very experienced at this game. I've seen somebody play it before, and then what you've seen of me playing it is pretty much all you got. She has glaucoma, and she has gigantism. Uh, scythe ability. There's that um, quantum translocator again. I, I really actually liked that. I could use that a lot. Low stats, uh, critical strikes. Oh yeah, we can go back and look at the people that have failed with. Johan! Oh, hey, he actually has a name. The Legendary Knight. I, I guess that's the first guy we fought with. Uh, so anyway, um, saying Sir Hershey, ooh, chocolate, Hershey chocolate, nobody else got that? Okay. But anyway, it's getting close enough to Halloween, I'm, a, I'm allowed to think about Hershey chocolate. Uh, class is the knave, uh, so that was what I was saying about the, the critical strikes. That is actually good, that was what was giving us, I think, the, uh, the twice as hard hitting thing with Lady Faye last time. Um, irritable bowel syndrome. I don't wonder how that's gonna work. Uh, coprolelia. I guess that's kind of like Tourette syndrome, or kind of like what uh, me, maybe PewDiePie have, where it's just like you cuss for uh, no particular reason or when you get hurt, and it's like an involuntary reaction. Um, yeah, I'm probably gonna go with that one. Let's see, Sir Scorpio. That's a really cool name. Uh, Knave, he's gay, likes the, he, he, he likes the man, he is a fan of the man. Uh, I am a fan of the man as well, so I can totally get behind that. Um, a risky hero, again, all knaves, oh no, two knaves and a paladin. I don't want to do with the paladin right now yet. Um, he's an endomorph, and he launches bounce orbs everywhere, that might also be fun. I uh, kind of want to go with him, I really want to go with him just because he's gay. <laughs> But we're actually going to go with Sir Hershey. Um, I actually wrote and submitted a story about gay knights recently to uh, Circlet Press. We'll see how that goes. We'll see if they accept that or not. Um, that will be fun if they do. I, I will definitely announce it on this channel if they actually do, you know, accept my uh, story and publish it in their anthology. Uh, let's see. Am I sure I want to begin a new adventure with this chosen hero? Not absolutely, but we're gonna do it anyway. Confirm. Okay, we're at the smithy. We've only got a tiny little bit of money. What do I want to do? It's 80 gold to unlock that, and then I will not have any more money to do a damn thing. Uh, let's exit the manor, check out 
Mr. Smithy over here. Let's see what he's got for us. Yeah, 250. Um, 350. 200. Okay. So, yeah. We're gonna go ahead and get, uh, let's see, mana up. Mental Fortitude. I'm gonna need that for this round, at least. Equip up, upgrades your carry capacity. We don't even have enough armor to worry about that right now. So, let's do that. Um, and it's 90 gold to unlock that, so we're going to be paying 40 gold to Tyron to escort us over the River Styx. Which, actually, if this is the River Styx that I'm standing on a bridge over, dude, for real? Like, you can't even get your boat and ferry me? Seriously, Chiron. Seriously, you're slacking. Yeah. Alright, let's do this. Hopefully we'll come back a little richer than we did last time. Alright, now entering Castle Hampson. Now, I'm usually OCD and want to break every damn thing in uh, everything, but uh, I've figured out there's a teleporter here. There's all this stuff here. It usually has mana or chicken or something in it. Not every time. Uh, we're actually going to leave it this time and uh, come back if I actually get to a teleporter. Uh, and, ooh, fuck you. Ah, fuck you again. Okay. Uh, I am sucking right now. Okay, teleporter. Um, maybe the first thing we come across, it's all the fucking same. Chicken? No, no chicken. Okay, fine. Um, what's the special button? Yeah, okay. So, that button again gets me out of trouble. If I have it. I got hit again. Oh, sh I'm not going to jump in here now. <sighs> How am I not? You can hit me from there, can't you? Plinky. You're just a little too low, Plinky. <sighs> don't, get, don't get too comfortable because I will probably have to buzz back to where I was. Oh, this looks not fun at all. I have a bad feeling about that painting. Oh, it's uh, the Frog Prince. Developers. I have one day. Development time 1.5 months. Release date April 15th, 2011. Huh. If you ever asked us all of uh, of all the game we made, which would one day be our favorite, there would be a unanimous agreement with I have one day. Okay, so they're talking about a game that they made. As children, we were raised on the adventure game classics like King's Quest, which is what I believe this is from are very similar. This looks like the Perils of Rosella. I do believe you grab a frog and give it a crown and it turns into a prince and abandons your ass in the middle of the forest, if I remember correctly. We might play through that one just for the hell of it. Uh, anyway, King's Quest, Monkey Island. So this was really our homage to some of the best experience we we ever had in gaming. Excuse my English. The game revolves around a meta-time puzzle where the player had only 24 hours to beat the game. Oh, that. Maybe if I were getting paid. Every puzzle had multiple solutions with time repercussions, which forced players to think of the best way to go about solving things. One interesting fact, the second ending was added at virtually the last minute, and without it, the entire game would have sucked. Okay, we we'll have to get to that. That's, that's, that's nice. I like that. You know, some, some people play to relax. Let me do some more relaxing games in the future. Games to relax. Not that my voice is the most relaxing. Whoop. Ah, eyeball, stop it. Whoop! I'm gonna wake Everett up. I, I know it. Let's see. What? Can I not see down there? I'm waiting for this bouncy thing to get the f out of my way. It's like as if it will ever. Oh, yeah? Alright. It was not as bad as I thought it could have been. Oh, sh sugar! Oh, why didn't I... Why didn't I push the button to zap myself back to the front? See... I got sidetracked. 
But um, anyway, in that instance, as I was falling, all I would have had to have done was push the key to transport me back to the front, and this all would not have happened. I'm sorry, Sir Hershey. I will eat chocolate in your memory. Alright, next air. What do we got to deal with? The feeble knave? Oh, I didn't know he was feeble. He was hitting harder than this useless bastard, I'll tell you that. Alright, uh, Sir Taco! The paladin. Nearsighted. Uh... Eat it in memory? I don't know about the memory thing. He's got the guardian shield, so... Uh, Ch Charles, the knave, the endomorph... Uh, I'm kind of- I'm still liking the names. I know they, they end really quickly. Like, yeah, you, they- you just get hit a lot. Stereo blind. Oh, he can't see things in 3D. Also gay. Sir Cellar. We're gonna go with him because the name of this company is Cellar Door and Cellar Door is pretty. He's a fan of the man. We're going to this guy. Let's go. Uh, 200 gold. Um, let's get out of the manor and go see what the smoothie's got to offer me right now. Oh god, that stereo blind thing is gonna screw me up. That's 250. Did I? Oh, I haven't unlocked the chest plates either one yet. Oh, I need 525 to do that. Let's get the square limbs. I know it's just a little bit of magic, but we're gonna do it anyway. Da -da -da. All right. Yeah, sure, Chiron here. You want some gold? Tough shit. Okay. Again, skipping all that. Anything new? No. No, but because we suck, there won't be anything new. Up, down, left, right. Last time I went down in the game. It was not as. Ugh. Why do I keep doing this? Hmm. You know what? It's probably a very chess play or something in here. That could have used some help there, man. Oh, well. Uh. Maybe afford an upgrade to the manor in a second? Okay. Carefully. Yeah, fuck it. Alright. Locked. What? What's that? On the map. Uh. Maybe that's a locked chest, perhaps. Oh. I suppose I should get a this shit. So there's a lock thingy. I'm assuming that was the chest. Just assuming. Alright, you know, what I really ought to be focusing on is collecting 500 and some odd gold. That includes this shit. Chicken and all, if there happens to be one. Nope. Hold on a minute. Not even any in the chair. Oh, the sadness. Okay. Yay, we're going down! Wasn't it better as I thought it was gonna be? Ugh, shit. You! You bastard! How do you like it? Okay, I totally deserve it. Whoa. Uh, I'm not a fan of smashing the statues, but in this case, money. So I got 270. What? Is that a. No, it's not shaking. Out of mana! Oh, yeah. Treating. It is okay to be a chicken when you're level one. Whoa! Okay, 
because our cellar has been slain by a Sharite. Runes are very powerful. Equip runes at the Enchantress and don't forget to use them. I'm actually gonna have to go back and look. Oh, no, wait. The glass guy had the... Whatever that other not to write syndrome thing is, it makes him cuss when he gets hurt. So his parting words are probably the same as my parting words are gonna be when I die. Uh, let's go ahead and do one more air and then we'll. What the hell? Skinny, everything sends you flying. Chakra. I never liked the chakra. Okay. Class knave. Trait, hypergonadism. You're permaroided. Attacks knock enemies further. We might do that, Sir Jacoby. Oh, Sir Grey, the barbarian. Alzheimer's. Aww. You have trouble remembering where you are. <laughs> He's a walking tank. Daggers or hypergonadism? Let's go with hypergonadism. Alright, we got 280 gold. Uh, you got anything for me, Smithy? Probably silly to buy stuff from you, honestly. I guess I could get the square sword finally. And I've got 30 gold. That's going to Kylan, isn't it? Yeah, there's no way. There's no way there's anything. I want to enjoy this background for a second. It's like a full moon. I, I know it says forest that we're supposed to be at the edge of the forest, but there's only a few trees and mountainous region in the back. But, uh, you know. You never know. Let's go, Kylan. Alright. Let's try for a little more money this time. Skipping all this once more. Or lying. Oh shit. Oh, you are you are freaking insane. Chicken's good. I believe she said that in the fifth element. Chicken good. And uh, she was right. It was a very good thing. Summoning gold. I uh, guess in a couple more pennies we can upgrade something. Just stood there and took that. Don't! He's missing everything, thing. kind of skill level for me on an ordinary basis. I'm out of mana, aren't I? I'm just so out of mana. It's alright, dude. Come on. Hey! Mana. Should've wasted on this guy? Nah. Oh, nice. Very good. Um, what's this way? Uh, sure. Greetings, adventure. I am here to give you a chance of a lifetime. For the measly sum of 25% of your current gold, or even 75, I'll give you a chance to open one of three chests. One chest will triple what you pay, the other two are empty. Sure, why not? Nothing. Nothing. Okay, so stupid. Okay. <laughs> Actually, that was more stupid than me paying gold. Alright. Uh, we didn't actually, whoa, squander a whole lot of gold there. Let's see what's behind door number two, because door number one does not like me! Oh, shit! What am I doing? Just make them come to you. What are they gonna do, huh? Chicken. <laughs> Get away from my gold. This doesn't despawn, does it? Whoa! Was doable. 
Yeah, you are doable as well, if I can actually do this. Alright. Come on. Money, money, money. <sighs> Twelve whole hit points left, dude. I think we need to get you back and see if there's any stuff left in the very first starter room. Really doubtful. Very, very doubtful. Try it anyway. Did I even leave anything in the first room this time? I don't even remember. Yeah, we Come on, chicken! Yes! Chicken. Chicken's good. Not that it's that good. I still probably only have one hit from any given thing in this dungeon, but it might help. Nope. I'm not doing that. Let's go back to kind of where we were. Avoid the spiky ball. I love seeing what's behind the windows in this game. Oh wait, I've already done this. Uh, check the map. This is the point where the moment 3D forgets to check the map. Okay, so we've only got two choices. They both suck, we're going to die one way or the other. Uh, I would assume. Because I'm just not that great. was not even fair. Uh, can I go do it this way? This is more nerve wracking. Yeah, it's more nerve wracking. Whoop. <sighs> Getting my head in the game? Not so much. What? Oh god. Do you just... Is it because he's tired? Okay. There! Jesus Christ. Oh. Nope. nope. I just decided nope. Yeah. That had to happen. a little better of a run than normal. Okay, we will see you guys next time. Oh yeah, uh, don't forget to click uh, like, subscribe, favorite, um, share if you liked it, and we will see you next time. Happy Halloween!